We try that again. I don't know why jumping on the bed is such a sport. <laughs> Three times and now I'm out of breath. Welcome my best friends on YouTube. This is Karina and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna be doing something different. I know I've promised you guys a try on all my jeans collection video for like 26 billion years ago. <laughs> but I never actually gotten around to filming that. And I don't know how many jeans I have. I don't know what they look like. So I'm just gonna go through my closet and take you guys through the amount of jeans I have and then order them. And then we can do a try on one by one. And I figure it's also like a good chance for me to like get rid of some jeans that I don't normally wear. I mean, if I don't even remember how many jeans I have, then it's probably time to let a few go. So yeah, let's go check out my closet right now. Okay guys, who remembers my extreme closet declutter video? If you guys saw that video, then you know that my closet was like fully super pretty and gorgeous looking and neat looking and then yeah, this is what it looks like currently. <laughs> I admit I have not been sticking to this scheme, but you know what? This is real life, guys. Ta-da! Here are my jean collection. So I'm just gonna grab all of this and put it onto the bed. And then now I'm gonna arrange them based on color from lightest to darkest. Oh, I honestly, it's like so hot in my room. I need like an ice cream break. Thumbs up if you like ice cream. The song or the food? Okay guys, so this is the first jeans that I'm trying on. If you guys remember back in my ASOS haul, this is the Levi's ribcage flare jeans, which I absolutely love. And so I'm keeping it. It does come with like these buttons. Do you guys see these buttons? When you sit down, it kind of like crunches in. But I love, love the length of this. The quality is really, really good. It's a premium Levi's. It has a tiny bit of a flare, but not too like 70s kind of flare, you know? I love how I'm sitting like this. Oh, this kind of video is the best. I will be linking every pair of jeans that I try on this haul in the description box down below. Make sure you check it out if you're interested in any of these. I just want to say that because some of these have been in my closet for like ever, um, they might have sold out by now or they might not. So yeah, check the link. <laughs> Absolutely love this pair of jeans. You see how I can just like sit on my bed like this? With the first pair of Levi's jeans, I couldn't even like bend in 90 degrees, but this one I can do like a full squat. So the material is very, very thin. It's super comfortable to be in. It's almost like lounge jeans, also from Shein, and has rips all over the place. So I'm not sure if it's good for school, but just <coughs> still suggest you guys to get it because it's such good value for your money. Size down if you want that high waisted look, and size up if you want that loose, relaxed fit. Hi! <laughs> It is from Shein and it's a really, really gorgeous like light blue color with these rips along the knee area. It's very thin. The material feels like really comfy, like thin denim material. Also, I heard that like rips are not appropriate for school and dress codes and it does have a very, very comfortable length and I'm 5'7 for reference and I think the length is just perfect for me. It has a straight cut and just goes with all your summer outfits because of the lighter color. Okay, you guys, I have like really, really mixed feelings about girlfriend denim jeans because while I love the brand itself, you'll see a lot of girlfriend denim denims <laughs> in this haul. Their sizing and the stiffness of their fabric is hella inconsistent, super duper inconsistent. This one is one of my favorite, favorite ones from girlfriend denim. It's a size 26, I believe, and look. I'm trying to show you my butt, you guys. There's nothing there anyway. I had to like freaking tie the back because if I don't, it is so loose around my waist. The reason I got 26 was because I got like a 25 on another girlfriend denim jeans and it was way too small for me. So I figured, you know, I'll just like size up to a 26 and this is what happens, you guys. I think, oh, it is so hot in here. My nail just fell off. My waist. My fake nails. FYI, this pair of jeans is exactly the same model and the same cut as these jeans, just in a different color. And I got this in a size 24 and it fits me like a dream. So I honestly think that I should have gotten these ones in a 24 as well. But yeah, I fully plan to take it to my tailor and like get a tailor <laughs> to fit around my waistline just because I love it so, so much. It also has like that really relaxed flare look. Super, super 90s. It's super long, has like a raw hem around the 
hem area it just kind of like drags on the floor as i walk i'm kind of like doing that style you know and it has no rips so it's definitely more of a classier pair of jeans <laughs> i'm sweating buckets okay guys so this Jean is the one I just showed you earlier in the size 24 and this one fits me so much better so yeah that just goes to show that when you're buying jeans on like a girlfriend down we really need to look at the reviews because the reviews really do give you a lot of information whether it fits true size or larger or smaller I love this one so much it's kind of like a darker blue color and why do I sound like I just ran like a mile but it has the same kind of like flare structure down the knees very very vintage I love it to death. The material is also like super duper great quality. It's organic cotton. You guys, it's been so many freaking billion years since I've worn a pair of skinny jeans. Okay, I'm the queen of exaggeration, but you guys know what I mean. Like, when was the last time you see me feature a pair of skinny jeans? When I put these on, I was so pleasantly surprised. It just feels so butterly smooth. It's from Girlfriend. It's the Kendall in 25. So it fits me like a dream. Super, super high-waisted. It comes up to my belly button and the length is just perfect. Like everything down from the design. There's a little rip here at the knees, um, down to my ankles area. I really think this is your classic pair of like ripped skinny jeans. Is that a song somewhere? Who is it by? Oh my god. Five sauce. I was like thinking a sauce. Five seconds of summer. I also forgot about this pair of jeans, you guys. Isn't it funny how we just like forget what we have and like go after what we don't have? Story of my life. These are the mom jeans from H&M, size US 4, and it fits me super, super well. It's also really, really high-waisted. It's a darker color, so it's perfect for the colder months. Um, it is a mom jeans, which means it's a slightly cropped at the ankle area, so you might need to wear like booties or like longer socks in the fall if you want to get cold. They're from H&M last season, but I believe H&M brought them back this year because they're so freaking popular and I can see why. They're like the perfect type of like walking, like doing things jeans. Who recognizes this pair of jeans? I've been preaching about these jeans for like ever. This is the jeans that you need to get, your mom needs to get, you need to buy for your best friend, you need to buy for your enemy. Whoever tries on these jeans will be so damn impressed with it. This is the perfect classic knee ripped black jeans that everyone should own. It's super high waisted. First of all, it doesn't even feel like jeans, okay? It feels like jeggings because it's so elastic. I have never come across a good pair of denim that is this elastic. <laughs> you guys all know I'm the giant, giant fan of stretchy things. So yeah, you can literally like do anything in these pair of jeans. You can like jump, you can like high kick, you can like do a split, like honestly, this is jeans to get. It's so classic, it goes with everything. You have to go up one size in these jeans, so I'm wearing a size 26, and it's from the brand Lovers and Friends. Okay, next up we have another pair of straight leg jeans from Affends. Affines. I'm not really sure how to pronounce that brand. It does come pretty straight legged, and it hits me slightly around my ankle, or like slightly above my ankle area. So I think it's supposed to be kind of like an in-between a mom jean and a straight leg jean. Branding size US 4, and it's definitely very, very comfortable to be in the fabric is like 100% cotton so it's very very smooth and soft whenever I wear it in a video you guys are like where's that jean from so there you go it's from Athens I bought it at Princess Polly I think they run out of stock pretty often but I do think it's one of um, the styles that Princess Polly does tend to restock pretty often as well as okay, this next pair of jeans is from super down it's a size 26 I believe and it fits me pretty well with the exception of the waist area being a little bit loose but it's nothing that a belt can't fix I actually think if I went down to 25 which is my normal size it would have been too tight for me I got it because I saw the reviews and everyone were like size up size up size up so I did this jeans is advertised as a girlfriend jeans I don't really know what girlfriend jeans are supposed to look like um, I think they're in between kind of like a straight leg jeans and a mom jeans these ones resemble more of a mom jeans to me it's slightly on the stiffer side of fabric but the design is also pretty timeless these jeans are the mica jeans from girlfriend denim again got in size 25 and it's supposed to be like a high rise slash mid rise type of jeans it hits me right in the middle of my belly button like right in the middle of it. I don't know if you classify that high waisted jeans. I really, really like the cut of these jeans. Even though the material is slightly on the stiff side, you really do have to break these in before they start to feel like second skin to you. I really like the design of these jeans because they're slim cut right around the thigh area and then right above your knee area is when they start to go like wider. So it's perfect, absolutely perfect for those of you who don't have the most straightest set of legs, if you know what I mean. Um, it just like camouflages and like make your legs look so long and so straight. You guys, I didn't even know I had these jeans. They're from Shein. They're like the perfect amount of bagginess. And I would have totally included it in my back to school lookbook if I had just 
remembered its existence because honestly it is like the most perfect baggy jeans perfect for back to school oh my god who saw my back to school lookbook by the way you know what if you did just mentally add these pairs of jeans <laughs> into the equation because yeah they are like perfect i love love those type of aesthetics where like you're wearing like a super super baggy pair of jeans and then you're wearing like a collar shirt like this and then you pair like an argyle sweater or vest over it bellissimo bellissimo i can't even sit down with these jeans <laughs> oh i don't know i'm kind of on the fence about these jeans they're also from girlfriend they are the nicole jeans and on the side the model made it look so good they do have a bigger flair to them than the rest of the jeans that i showed earlier yeah i don't know if i'm feeling it the fabric is just way too tight oh my god it's like cinching in my waist so hard even though it makes my butt look so good you do really need to wear them with heels i think that's when you will really start to see an elongation with your legs because you don't wear heels and you don't want to be suffocated and <laughs> don't get these these next jeans, this one is actually more of like a cropped skinny fit it does have these like two-tone things going Also very high-waisted, I'm not sure if I'm loving this Actually, yeah, I don't think I'll be keeping it It may be nice for like spring or summer But yeah, now that we're going into the fall and winter months What do you guys think? I freaking love these pairs of jeans If you guys remember this jean, it's actually from the K-pop lookbook that I did a while ago And it's Lisa's jeans Okay, it's not actually Lisa's jeans, but you know, it's the jeans that I picked to recreate Lisa's outfit Oh my god, I absolutely love these pairs of jeans Maybe it's because I've associated it mentally with her Super duper high-waisted, fits me like a dream It's from Nasty Gal, it's a size US 4 Honestly, if it's still available, you have to grab it right now Yeah, I'm not feeling this next pair of jeans, I think It's like out of style <laughs> i can't be 100 percent sure on that i just haven't seen a lot of people wear it i mean i guess celebrities wear it from time to time it's just like so ripped because you're interested that these jeans are from that scale and i'm wearing it in this size us4 but oh my god when i like sit down these like distressed frays are like digging into my flesh and like it's making my knee look like a michelin baby <laughs> i think you guys can see it these next jeans are from Shein. I'm wearing a size extra small. I can usually do an all Shein jeans. I think when I got it in like one of the Shein hauls from before, I was like really, really happy with it. But now that I'm trying all my other jeans, I'm noticing that these ones feel and look a lot like some of the other ones that I own, but it's not as long. Like these ones don't touch the floor and they don't like sweep the floor as I walk. So I don't like that. I like it when my jeans sweep the floor. And another thing is like these jeans don't have pockets. Like what the effing f? Like how does it not have pockets? I just don't understand any jeans that don't have pockets. Ripped jeans from Pistola. I'm wearing a size 24. I think I got it from Lulu's like a while ago. So I'm not sure if they still carry it. But yeah, I got it because Pistola is such a good brand. Honestly, the fabric is like really, really amazing. It's like a buttery fabric. But the only thing I would say about these is that these like knee rips keep hurting me. Like they legit like dig into my flesh as I sit down and like hurt me. <laughs> it's not pleasant. Also not very sure about these. Can you guys let me know if I should keep it or like let it go? Next we have this black misguided jeans. It's super high-waisted. I'm wearing a size US 4, which is normally my size because the US 4 in the H&M one fits me super perfectly. And this one is just like, like it's so loose around my waist. I definitely think that you should size down for this one. I don't know if misguided still carries this, but I do hope they're going to restock because it is one of their most popular styles. Like they always sell out as soon as they restock. These jeans also have the same problem as the previous misguided one because this is so baggy and loose in a size 4. So yeah, you should definitely size down for this one as well. It's from Nasty Gal and I believe they're currently sold out as well. Whenever I get jeans from Nasty Gal and Misguided, they always tend to like sell out really quick and then they just like don't restock. Whenever I get jeans from Shein and Revolve, they always restock their stuff, which is amazing. Which is why I keep going back to get stuff from there because then I can share it with you guys and you guys can actually get something for yourself if you like something that I'm wearing because otherwise, you know, it would just be like frustration fest for everyone. Okay, last pair of jeans. Of course, I've forgotten that they existed, but when I first put these on, I was like, WTF. I don't know why I kept it. I think I was like captivated by the split hem design down the skinny leg. It's not really like my style, you know? So definitely we'll be letting these go. Okay, guys, we've come to the end of my jean collection video. I don't know why I'm posing like this as if I'm starring in a K-pop music video right now, you know? 
Ooh, let me know in the comments down below if you would like to see something similar to this, but maybe for like skirts, so like my skirt collection. I have been like putting off my shoes collection one. I know that I've promised some of you that I'll do a shoe collection haul, but like dude, bro, it is so freaking hard to get all my shoes in order. Okay, I love you all and I'll see you in my next video. Bye! Light blue color. Dream. Now, so for rip rip case, guys, I have this elastic. Absolute love featuring.